Hey, it's Jason with Strength Running here, and today I want to introduce you to the standard core routine. If you're not familiar, this is a core routine that I consider a bread and butter core workout for runners. It hits every single muscle that is important for us, and it really is a more comprehensive core workout than just focusing on your abs. This routine hits your abs, your obliques, your glutes, your hamstrings, your hips, and many other muscles that comprise your entire core region. The routine consists of six exercises that you do in a circuit. In other words, you go from exercise to exercise to exercise without taking any rest. And what I love about this routine is that you can make it really hard or you can make it fairly easy. And you do that one of two ways. You can increase the number of sets. You can do one, two, or three sets. And the other way is by doing the exercise for a longer period of time. You could do it for 30 seconds on up to a minute. And ideally, runners can build to about three sets of this routine at 60 seconds per exercise. If you can do that maybe two or three times a week, you're gonna develop incredible core strength, you're gonna reduce your injury risk, and you're gonna find that you're running a lot more economically than usual. So let's get started. I'm gonna go through the exercises right now for you and walk you through a couple different variations. So. If one version of the exercise is too easy, you can make it a little bit more challenging. Let's get started. And there we have it, the standard core routine, six exercises, incredibly runner specific. If you can do this three times a week, if you can build to a minute per exercise and do three sets of this routine, you're gonna build incredible strength, incredible injury resiliency, and you're just gonna feel a lot better when you're out there running. You're gonna feel like you're stronger, like your form is more economical and efficient. So if you haven't yet started this routine, or a very similar routine, I would encourage you to get started as soon as you can because this is one of those routines where the benefits really compound over time and it really might expose a lot of your weaknesses. So for example, the final exercise that you just saw, the supine leg lift, is one of the more challenging exercises and if you find that you can't do it, if your form suffers, if you can't get your butt off the ground, then that means we need to work on your glute and hip strength. So that's just one example. Uh, I know this routine is gonna expose some of those weaknesses, which is a good thing, because then it shows you what you have to work on, what you have to improve, so that you can continue to get stronger and continue improving. 
Now we do have a PDF download for this routine so that you don't have to watch me do all the exercises every time. There's a link under this video to get it so that just print it out. You can put it wherever you do your core work, tape it to a tree out in the local park, and you can always know what exercises to do and in what order. So I hope you found this helpful. Here's to getting a lot stronger.